pretty difficult actually to come up with this menu actually to blend the two cuisine together. Because Japanese food is kind of, uh, it's it's not over the top or like bang, you know, it's, it's not gonna be super spicy or super anything. It's like, it's very well balanced and it's more accentuating ingredients. So when we started thinking about doing this, it was kind of like what Indian components are we gonna put in with this? So we were going through that as we were shopping. There are scallops, there is lamb chops, there is tuna, salmon. We have uh, okra, vegetables, vegetables mushrooms. mushrooms, lots of different stuff. From those, we're gonna select actually kind of like which blends nicely with, you know, the flavors of both the cuisine. The idea behind this collaboration is to, you know, meld the two restaurants kind of together and take some, some influence from Jua, some influence from charcoal and blend them together. So that being said, I mean, um, basically we're using some proteins from here and we're using some proteins from Jua and then we're using sauces and, and spices from both sides. So we're trying to figure out what or how this is going to work with Indian and Japanese, which I don't know that it's ever been done. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, you know, uh, why, you know, we collaborate on this part is like because, you know, Jua just does some pretty nice stuff doing the grilling of the uh, ingredients over charcoal. So that's what the charcoal also does. So charcoal is all about, you know, grilling, you know, roasting meat in an oven. I mean, it's all based on charcoal. It has to be dry heat preparations. Join us and try out some fusion of Japanese and Indian together. I think it's going to be very interesting, the dishes that come out. Yep. I invite everyone to come in and enjoy the flavors of Jua X charcoal.